Hi everyone, we're just giving you a bit of a demo of the new live sync feature in Blackmagic Cloud. So you can see I'm recording on an iPhone 15 with the Blackmagic camera app, and now we're live recording into the bin. So it's like we're live streaming into the bin. So you can see the icon has a record indicator on it, which means this camera is actually recording. And if we go down into the viewer here, you can scroll along a bit, and you can see, I think it just happened then, if I go in a bit closer, you can see the media is actually coming into the viewer live as the camera is recording. So you'll see that uh, playback indicator there, it'll jump back. So you just saw it there as the media is continuing to come in. And so we can also do it on a second camera. So if we come back to, we're gonna notice the Broadcast G2 here. So if we start recording on there, and you can see I'm recording into the same project above the time code there. So both of these cameras are recording in the same uh, project. So we're gonna have this update on the Ursa Broadcast G2 as well as the cinema camera and the Ursa Senian Pixis and the Blackmagic Camera app will also support this and obviously Blackmagic Cloud itself. So if we go back down to here, we should be able to see the second camera will come in automatically. There it is there. There's the turn. It's also got the record indicator showing that it's recording. So both of these cameras are recording live. And if we go down here, we can see that you can actually uh, scroll between the two cameras. See? And so you can see one after the other. And then the other thing we're doing is if we come back a bit, you can see we've actually got two DaVinci Resolves, both connected to the same project. So what's happening is the medias are coming up from two different cameras to Blackmagic Cloud, then coming down to two separate DaVinci systems. They could be anywhere in the world. You could have one on set, one back in a post-production facility. So it's pretty cool. And then if we want to work with the two cameras, we can use the multi-source feature up here, and then that'll give them as a, a multi-view. So now you can see the, where the cameras line up. In fact, if we scroll a little bit earlier, you see that we only had the first camera rolling. So it's just the first camera, and then if we go to the second bit, and if you hit play, you can see it playing. So there it is. So that's how the new live sync feature in DaVinci Resolve works. And you can click a camera, and you can actually just play back out of the viewer and kind of you know have a broadcast workflow where the file streaming into the bin, and you just play back in DaVinci, and you can play straight to air you know, 20 or 30 seconds after the camera's recording, but it means you can record uh, an important event and start editing the content immediately without waiting for that event to finish because the camera can just keep recording. So it's pretty cool. So there it is. Now, live sync on Blackmagic Cloud. It'll be available in a couple of weeks' time and we'll be showing it at the trade shows. So if you're at any of the shows, come by and check it out. Thanks.